Hi everybody, Sean for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Here doing a 2020 Panini Donruss Optic Baseball 12 box case break. Pick your team number four. Release day. We've got the case right here in front of us. And here is the list of everybody that got in. Thank you very much. Brandon at Richards with the Arizona Diamondbacks in last spot mojo, as well as the St. Louis Cardinals for so two spots, last spot mojo. All number cards and autos and everything will be sleeved and top loaded. For the sake of time, we'll be sleeving anything under 25 on numbered cards and autos right now. Good luck, everyone. We just did pick your team number two of this. Very nice stuff. And at the end of the break, we will do a recap on autos and numbered cards, uh, lower numbered numbered cards. So if you'd like to, you can go ahead and skip forward in the video and see the highlights. But for those that are watching live, welcome. Hope this one is as good, if not better than the first. Opening day baseball tomorrow. First game, Yankees at reigning national cha or World Series champions, Washington Nationals. I mean, yeah, well, there's definitely some very nice stuff in uh, pick your team number two. If you guys go over to that video after this, check out the highlights. A little recap at the end. Big name rookies, big name stars, low numbered auto parallels. Didn't see Jason Dominguez in that one. Maybe we can see him in this. Did have a Wander Franco auto in that first, in the last one. Jordan Alvarez, Bo Bichette. Yeah, David, that one actually worked out well for you. That uh, Devers auto out of 20, really nice. Yeah, yeah. Ronald Acuna Jr., gold auto to 10. See, that's pretty good. Maybe we can see a gold vinyl in this one. Last one was, uh, the last case that we had was the Stars and Stripes. Shohei Otani that went to the Angels. Very nice looking card there. Apparently there's also a Fort Knox, is that the other potential case hit? That would be a, a improvement, David. I am, Joe. And, and I, I'll do it as long as you invite me back. So 
So we'll have another full day of breaks tomorrow, guys. Joe from 1 to 9. Me for as long as you'll have me after that. That's my Friday, so... I know somebody put it in the chat earlier. Obviously, we said Yankees Nationals is opening game. What's the second game of the day? Uh, Giants at Dodgers. Very cool. Nice. It's going to be awesome seeing actual like baseball, competitive baseball being played again and counting. That's why we play the game well. Who are opening day starters? Cole versus Scherzer. That's a cool matchup. Garrett Cole and his big money contract. Good luck, everyone. Trent Grisham, rated rookie, blue to 75 for the Padres. And Jeff Gordon. Gavin Lux, hollow. First auto, Sam Hilliard, rated rookie auto for the Colorado Rockies. And Fred Salvatore. Nolan Arenado Hollow uh, there. Pete Alonso Mythical Hollow. Manny Machado Mythical. Brandon Lau for the Tampa Bay Rays to 150. Tampa Bay Richard Zitterman. Gavin Lux Stained Glass Hollow. For the Dodgers and Jason Sarmiento. Second auto, rated rookie, Sean Murphy for the Oakland Athletics. And Ian Rockwood. Adley Rushman, rated prospect, hollow. Javi Baez to 35 for the Cubs and Eric Ainge. Uh, there will, uh, as far as, other than the ones that are already posted, I do not know. We'll have to take a look and see. Sheldon Noose, rated rookie auto, black, for the Oakland Athletics to 50. Oakland Athletics is Ian Rockwood. Aristides Aquino, mythical. Hollow. 
Mauricio Dubon, rated rookie, to 199 for the Giants. Giants is going to Michael Armstrong. Oh. Fireworks Gold, Yon Mancata, 10 out of 10 for the Chicago White Sox and Adam Harper. Very nice looking card there. Paul Goldschmidt to 100 for the Cardinals and Brandon Richards, last spot mojo. Marcus Simeon to 199 for the Oakland A's and Ian Rockwood. Sure. Why not? Release day, everything goes quick. Been fun, uh, good looking stuff too. Yeah, Joe, I'm good. It'll still, I'll still have plenty of time and effort and or energy to be able to clean everything up and make it look as good as possible. So, well, I get, I get a solid like four to six hours of sleep a night. It gets me through. Thanks, man. Yeah, sure, Joe. Yeah, Goldie's always been a fan of a favorite of mine. Back to the Arizona days. That is true. So tomorrow night, guys, we can go until you guys say no. Uh, Darksiders, we hit two earlier today. I'm not sure if they were from separate breaks or the same break, but I do know we hit two. I'm throwing I'm throwing right now like I know that I'm set up for uh for Tommy John's coming up, you know? You don't know if you like either one of them, Brandon, or you don't know which one you like more. More? I mean, personally, I'd say Kershaw. 
the Kershaw matchup for him is a better bet than the Cole matchup. I mean, think about what Kershaw has done to the Giants. Pretty much his entire career, right? I think I see a gold right there. Uh, there you go, Adam. Joe's got the answer on that one. Autos, numbered card, rookies, parallels, those will all ship. I, Brandon, I've loved watching the videos of like, you know, Joe Adele hitting a like screaming home run, line drive home run off the scoreboard. Just the sound of the bat is so much clear, you know, more crisp now and everything. It's pretty cool. I think it'd be cool if, um, I mean, it'd be impossible to regulate, but if they did, um, if they did a, like, you know, like at the drive-in movie theaters in like the stadium parking lots at the games, that'd be cool. Yeah, I remember that, Brandon. It was actually a really good game, too, if I remember. I think that'd be cool if they if they opened up the parking lots to uh, like a drive-in theater for the game. You listen to it on your radio. You could cheer and, and react with your uh, your horn, honking your horn. We heard from the broadcast. Right? Mm-hmm. Any of the big stadiums, that'd be awesome. Especially the open air ones, not the indoor. But you know somebody would do something stupid and ruin it for everybody else, unfortunately. Debbie Grulon, rated rookie auto for the Phillies and Eric Jock. Tommy Edmond for the Cardinals to 100. St. Louis Cardinals, Brandon Richards. Domingo Leba, rated rookie blue auto for the Arizona Diamondbacks and Brandon Richards, number to 75. Ryan Mountcastle, optic autographs for the Baltimore Orioles and Jorge Mir. For liability purposes, I doubt that they let anybody even in the parking lot. I mean, it's just not worth it. Tres Pereira, 
Washington Nationals orange to 100. Washington Nationals and Amber Bishop. And another rated rookie auto for Jordan Alvarez. Houston Astros and Johnny Cannon. Bobby Witt Jr., Rated Prospect, Hollow. Shohei Otani, Pink to 199 for the Los Angeles Angels and John McCall. Tres Barrera for the Nationals to 50. Nationals and Amber Bishop. I mean, 50 is a low number, Brandon. Trevor Story for the Rockies to 125. Rockies and Fred Salvatore. And the auto for the San Francisco Giants. Fireworks auto, Luis Matos. Giants and Michael Armstrong. And then... Joe Palumbo for the Texas Rangers gold to 10. Texas Rangers and Matt Stubblefield. Albert Pujols, pink to 199 for the Angels and John McCall. Tony Gonsolin, rated rookie to 150 for the Dodgers and Jason Sarmiento. Chris Paddock, pink to 199 for the Padres and Jeff Gordon. Shane Bieber, pink to 199 for the Cleveland Indians and Dan Tursky. Dustin May, rated rookie for the Los Angeles Dodgers to 100. Jason Sarmiento. Jorge Polanco for the Twins to 100. Minnesota Twins and Jarrett Korfosh. Pete Alonzo for the New York Mets. Red to 60. New York Mets, Richard Zitterman. Michael Baez, blue, rated rookie to 75 for the San Diego Padres and Jeff Gordon. Abraham Toro, pink. To 199 for the Astros and Johnny Cannon. Logan Allen for the Indians to 75. Cleveland Indians is Dan Tursky. George Springer for the Astros to 199. Johnny Cannon. Madison Bumgarner pink to 199. For the Diamondbacks and Brandon Richards, last spot mojo. Bo Bichette, hollow. Bruce Star Gratterall, pink rated rookie auto. For the Twins and Jarrett Corfage. Jorge Soler, pink to 199 for the Kansas City Royals. And Fred Schultz. Eugenio Suarez, black to 125 for the Cincinnati Reds. And Jared, Jerry Bennington. Debbie Grulon to 76 for the Phillies. And Eric Jock. JD Martinez Black to 125 for the Red Sox. That's going to Daniel Graham. Randy Arena, Tampa Bay Rays to 150. That's going to Richard Zitterman. And Juan Soto Blue to 75 for the Washington Nationals and Amber Bishop. Yeah, the blue, uh, the 
The 76 variation is really nice. Uh, the Juan Soto, that's Amber Bishop and the Washington Nationals. Four boxes down, guys. Third of the way through. So we're talking about gamesmanship and things that are allowed and that aren't. What about a rod rounding second base on that pop up and yelling, I got it, as the shortstop's trying to field it. Fair play? Classless? What do you think? It's mind tricks, but at the same point, I mean, yeah, that's stuff you stop doing in Little League. Or what was the, uh, who was the pitcher that he, he swatted, swatted his arm as he was trying to tag him out at first, on the play at first, for the Reds, right? I forget who that was. Bron Bron Bronson Arroyo? Maybe the new owner of the part owner of the Mets. Which one is, was he joking about when he when he then sat on second base and swore that he he should have been safe? And that it was a baseball move and he was just running his arm, running. Forcing Jeter to go back to first when he would have actually been on second anyways. The fact that he argued it, like, it, it's, it was a bad move. The fact that he argued it with such, such conviction while standing on second base, swearing that he, you know, he had a right to be there. And Jeter, you know, head rounded home and scored. It's pretty bad. Yeah, but like, ugh. it's stuff like that that comes back, and you're, and you know, he he trashes, you know what? He kind of sides against the players now.
Yeah, it's one of the worst. I mean, the fact that, like, he didn't even try to, like, you know, like, swing an uppercut or anything like that. He had, like, a loose, limp wrist. I remember, I remember when that first happened, there were people that were, like, photoshopping, you know, purses and stuff on his, like, bent, bent wrist. Honestly, I hope somebody actually starts. If he if he becomes the Mets owner, I hope people start making memes about him. Yeah, like when it's a joke, you've got the guy on second base sitting there, and he's kind of like you know they cover their mouth with the glove or whatever, and they talk, and he goes, "There's no way you're gonna get away with this." He goes, "You might as well like walk back to back to your dugout stuff like that." A Rod was. One, it doesn't seem like A-Rod had a good relationship with a lot of other players in the league, you know? I mean, it's hard not to be, I, I guess, it's all in his mind, in the mind, but like, can you imagine being as young as he was, coming up with the Mariners and being that good, and openly talked about as, in regards to, you know, how crazy, how, how good is he going to be, you know what I mean? Like, nobody was there to ground him. He let it all go to his head, he got as cocky as he needed to be, and... It got him to where it needed to be. I think, and Joe, I think it's because, unlike Bonds and Clemens, he hasn't gone into his cave and waited for it to die down or, you know, trying to avoid the limelight. He's out there. He owns it, you know. I like the way that McGuire's done it. What up, Teddy? Rico Garcia, blue rated rookie auto to 75 for the Rockies and Fred Salvatore. Teddy Jaspi. Mauricio Dubon. Rated rookie blue auto for the San Francisco Giants. Going to Michael Armstrong. That's number to 75. Mitch Hanniger. Blue for the Mariners to 75. Seattle Mariners is Eric Ainge. Danny Mendick, rated rookie, hollow, auto. Nice signature by Danny Mendick. Chicago White Sox and Adam Harper. Ooh. Color matching auto. Aristides Aquino. For the Cincinnati Reds and Jerry Bennington, numbered to 50 on that. Congrats, Jerry. Sammy Sosa is also trying to convince people that he hasn't done anything to his skin. Jake Fraley for the Mariners to 125. Seattle Mariners and Eric Ainge.
Aaron Judge Black to 125 for the New York Yankees and Michael Alarcio. Brian Reynolds Black to 125 for the Pirates and Cooper Doucette. Kyle Kendricks, orange to 100 for the Cubs and Eric Ainge. Alex Bregman to 150 for the Astros and Johnny Cannon. Mookie Betts, pink to 199 for the Los Angeles Dodgers and Jason Sarmiento. Aaron Judge, black to 125 for the Yankees. And Michael Ars Alarcio. Josh Bell, black to 125 for the Pirates and Cooper Doucette. Andres Jimenez, rated prospect, auto for the New York Mets and Richard Zitterman, number to 50. Brock Burke, red to 60 for the Texas Rangers and Matt Stubblefield. Corey Kluber, blue, to 75 for the Rangers, and Matt Stubblefield. Rico Garcia for the Giants, to 150. San Francisco Giants is Michael Armstrong. Reese Hoskins, pink, to 199 for the Phillies, and Eric Jock. Zach Collins, for the Chicago White Sox to 25. Chicago White Sox is Adam Harper. Buster Posey, red to 60 for the Giants and Michael Armstrong. Donnie Walton, orange to 100 for Seattle and Eric Ainge. Josh Rojas to 35 for the Diamondbacks and Brandon Richards, last spot mojo. Edwin Rios, black for the Dodgers to 25, going to Jason Sarmiento. Walker Bueller, red for the Dodgers to 60, also going to Jason Sarmiento. Jonathan Hernandez to 35 for the Rangers and Matt Stubblefield. And rated rookie auto, black for the Miami Marlins, Jordan Yamamoto. That's number to 50. Miami Marlins is Matt Stubblefield. Starling Marte, pink to 199 for the Arizona Diamondbacks. And Brandon Richards, last spot mojo. Lucas Giolito, gold to 10 for the Chicago White Sox. And Adam Harper. Halfway through, guys.
Joe, are teams, uh, are players still allowed to stay at home? Or are they all, even on home games, are they staying in a hotel or what? Because, like, comfort of home obviously still plays in the factor of home field advantage, but if they're all living out of hotels. Yeah, Matt, have they figured that out yet for them? That'd be kind of cool, Brandon. Somebody said earlier that the minor league ballpark in Buffalo apparently doesn't have proper lighting. I mean, so is nowhere in Canada option? Not even the uh, Expos where they played? Isn't that stadium still uh, up and ready? So is it just Canada's a no-go whatsoever? Catch a tune. Hmm. Uh, super bad. We're going to be doing this and then potentially a Goodwin Champions. Aren't they already in Florida? What is this royal pudding you talk about, Matt? I'm not a big fan of pudding, but it does sound pretty good right now. For some reason, the, the texture, consistency with the coldness. South Park, Canada? I'll have to look it up. I do love me some South Park. Royal Wedding. Now Matt, is it is it based off of anything somewhat real? Or is it just a joke?
See you guys. Have a good night. Fernando Tatis Jr. Pink to 199 for the Padres. Going to Jeff Gordon. Michael Baez to 125 for the Padres and Jeff Gordon. Brandon Lau to 125 for the Rays and Richard Zitterman. And Fireworks Auto, Aristides Aquino for the Cincinnati Reds and Jerry Bennington. Congrats, Jerry. Ooh. Is that Mr. Mike Trout? And it is. Stars and Stripes, case hit. For the Los Angeles Angels and John McCall. Congrats, John. Last case, it was uh, Shohei Otani. Sean bringing the Angels mojo. Javi Baez to 125 for the Cubs and Eric Ainge. Sam Hilliard, rated rookie auto for the Rockies and Fred Salvatore. Kettle Marte for the Arizona Diamondbacks to 199 and Brandon Richards last spot mojo. Sean Murphy rated rookie hollow auto for the Oakland Athletics and Ian Rockwood. Wander Franco, hollow. Max Muncy, red for the Dodgers to 60. Los Angeles Dodgers, Jason Sarmiento. Garrett Cole, red for the New York Yankees to 60. New York Yankees, Michael Alarcio. Michael, I apologize for butchering your name multiple times throughout this break. So do you guys think the beaning them is actually worth it with um, suspensions or stuff coming from it? Like, especially in a shortened season? Regular season, sure.
but like a loss, a loss this year is equivalent to what losing a weekend series. So if you have, you know, a pitcher that's not available or something like that. Can you imagine a fight breaking out this year? The entire team would be suspended. They would, I, I mean, I couldn't imagine what they would do. Like, they wouldn't let the, the season continue, would they? If anybody deserves it, it's Korea. That guy sucks. Like, I'm not saying throw in the neck area, but just throw it as hard as you can into the soft part of the ribs as many times as possible. Like, his entire reaction to this thing, you know... Altuve was involved. The whole the whole thing about, you know, not taking off your shirt because your wife doesn't want to and stuff like that after you hit the walk-off home run. That all that all is just way too much. Like I get it, man. He he's incredible. I think he's more likely than anybody any any of the people that cheated on that team to maintain a semblance of what his numbers were. And still be very, very good. But there's no question that he cheated. Not a question that he cheated. And the fact that, like, you go back and you see that video of him saying, no, don't tear off my jersey, and he, like, points to his chest. Come on. I mean, the guy's incredible. Yeah, he went and changed. He went into the locker room to change into his his championship T-shirt. Hold on, let me go. Let me. I'm shy all of a sudden. I haven't been the center of attention, however many times before. They still have the championship. I mean, I'm not going to take that away from them. But, I mean, come on. But Cali's Finest, it's like, it's easily done. They're easily programmed. Yeah.
Well, absolutely, Matt. But we're also not taking a guy off the street, giving him, you know, all the tools to cheat, and then, you know, saying, hey, good luck. We're taking guys that have already made the pros and saying, well, here's a little bit more of an advantage. Like Trout said, if I knew what pitch was coming, he, he'd be unstoppable. Do you think, uh, do you think any, any pitcher, if you told Mike Trout what pitch you were throwing, do you think anybody would be able to get him, get him out on a regular basis? I mean, he's incredible under pressure. everyone. Fox is 9 and 10. Ooh. Vlad Guerrero Jr. Signature Series autograph for the Toronto Blue Jays and David M. Congrats, David. I know you said you were staying up for this. Miguel Cabrera to 125 for the Tigers and Chad Breitner. Jordan Alvarez rated rookie hollow. And Aaron Savale rated rookie auto for the Cleveland Indians and Dan Tursky. Garrett Cole Pink to 199 for the Yankees and Michael Arcio. Brian Anderson to 76 for the Miami Marlins. Miami Marlins and Matt Stubblefield. What's up, Rex? Uh, I've got at least one more break in me after this. I think Joe's taking the ball away from me after that. Yadier Molina, pink for the Cardinals to 199. St. Louis Cardinals and Brandon Richards. Rated rookie hollow auto, Zach Gallen for the Arizona Diamondbacks and Brandon Richards. Chris Bryant 
to 75 for the Chicago Cubs and Eric Ainge. Michael King for the New York Yankees. Rated rookie auto. New York Yankees is Michael Alarcio. Cody Bellinger pink for the Dodgers to 199. Los Angeles Dodgers, Jason Sarmiento. Bo Bichette, the rookies hollow. Two more boxes to go, guys. See you, Joe. Joe, am I good to do the Goodwin Champions after this, or what's the deal? What did you What did you decide? Okay, cool. Thanks, man. So, guys, Goodwin Champions number five is going to be after this, and then I guess good night. We got some cleaning up to do. We have special guests tomorrow. Cool. Thanks, man. But after our guests leave tomorrow, I get to stay up as long as you guys want me to. I don't have to check in with my mom. Joe's got a big day ahead of him tomorrow. Mama already, already, she already knows. It was actually just her birthday last week. Shout out mom. And moms everywhere. Jaspies. Big fan of the moms. Last two boxes, guys. Thanks for sticking with it. Let's get some good mojo going for uh, anybody that may ha uh, may not have hit so far. For those that have, let's see if we can just make it even that much better of a break. When do we hire, um, Joey? That's a uh, that's all up to the big boss, man. They do it based on need and stuff like that. So uh, I know, I think coming up soon, they might be doing something with sorting that I heard, uh, looking for people to help with that. So I mean, Gliber? Yeah. Yeah, no worries, Joe.
I don't, I can't think of who the Twins catcher is. But Brandon's talking tomorrow between the four teams playing tomorrow. So Giants, Dodgers. Um, Nationals, Yankees. Oh, Mitch Garver. Joey, Teddy is a uh, world of knowledge. You guys should ask him how he did in his, uh, his mock draft last night. Uh, no, Mitch Garver is not playing tomorrow night, Brandon. That's why I'm thinking between the four tomorrow night, uh, Gliber. Yeah, I mean, it's not worth it for you, Joey. Well, this one, his his draft was uh, was for football. Are you guys, you guys are allowed to bet on sports that aren't yours, right? I'm assuming. I mean, I feel like pro, pro play, uh, players bet on uh, other sports all the time. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, Gary Sanchez. That's who I meant. That guy. But maybe Glaber also is a play catcher. The Kraken. There you go. Yeah. I mean, not betting, not gambling is also a good way to keep your money in your pocket in a lot of cases, so. are usually skewed a little bit so that more often than not it's not going to go that way there you go Brandon I'd just be happy for you winning what you do with the money after that that's up to you. I just think it'd be cool to be in a, the presence of a winner. You can go to Vegas, Callie. I mean, I don't know if I'd recommend it, but you can. Under. Aquino, the rookie's hollow. Javi Baez to 150 for the Cubs. Eric Ainge. Wander Franco, prospects, hollow. Yeah, that's a good call.
Jose Altuve pink to 199 for the Astros and Johnny Cannon. Yu Chang, rated rookie hollow auto for the Cleveland Indians and Dan Tursky. Trent Grisham, rated rookie pink to 199 for the San Diego Padres and Jeff Gordon. Aquino, rated rookie hollow. And Victor Mesa Jr., auto for the Miami Marlins, rated prospect to 50. Miami Marlins is Matt Stubblefield. Jose Ramirez Black to 125 for the Indians and Dan Tursky. Nick Solak, rated rookie auto for the Texas Rangers and Matt Stubblefield. Rated Rookie Auto Gold, Dylan Cease for the Chicago White Sox and Adam Harper. Adam, you can kind of see right there, belt line to the left. You can see a crease in the middle. Just wanted to show you, obviously, packed fresh. That's numbered 7 out of 10. Nice auto. Sorry about that. Andrew Vaughn, rated prospect, hollow. Paul Goldschmidt, Diamond Kings, to 76 for the St. Louis Cardinals. And Brandon Richards. Nice. This should make up for that uh, crease in that auto. You can still contact Panini about that, but Luis Robert, rated rookie to 76. Congrats. Very cool. That's our break, guys. We'll do a recap on the autos and hits number 25 or lower. All other numbered cards will be sleeved and top loaded. Matt, wouldn't that be crazy if they did, though? If they won? You'd have Jeter saying that he was he knew what he was doing this whole time. And then he'd sell it all off, right?
Okay, guys. A little recap. Mike Trout, case hit, stars and stripes. Very nice break, everybody. That was Panini Don Russ Optic. 12 box case break. Pick your team number four. I'm Sean, jazbeescasebreaks.com. We've got more in store. Check it out, and we'll see you next time. Thanks.